So is this because the southern states in America didn't want opposed to that? a large degree that was the, the oh, influence wow. of the southern states? Okay, and actually there are letters between Dessalines mm -hmm. uh, that is, I mean, he sent letters to uh, Thomas Jefferson saying that Haiti had established its independence; it was not going to export it to the southern parts of the United States, and it was not going to support, I mean, uh, spread it throughout the Caribbean, that he shouldn't be afraid of that, and that he wanted good relations with Jefferson. Jefferson never answered that. <laughs> Jefferson, the guy that he wrote our declaration. He, of yeah, he ignored <laughs> it, and, and it was a Paria nation on its own. So and, interesting. You know, the, the thing is that uh, the southern uh, uh, white slave uh, owners were terrified about the Haitian re revolution. I mean, people did talk in the South about Haiti. It became some sort of uh, obsession and it became... Uh, By people, you mean white threat. Southerners or also uh, African? Southerners in particular okay. who were terrified about the Haitian revolution because they thought it might lead to uh, the downfall of slavery. And that slaves might look at Haiti and say, oh, my goodness. We can do this, uh, too. We can do it, too, in the southern part of the United States. So there was fear uh, of that in the southern part of the United States. And there was also, uh, and that was a minority group, but abolitionists who look at Haiti as the beacon of freedom. Uh, and that, those things have been underreported. It's way after uh, that period that Haiti is, to, to some extent, ignored. But at the time of the revolution, it is absolutely clear uh, that southern white slave owners were terrified of Haiti. And they wrote things. There were novels about Haiti saying that Haiti is going to bring barbarism to the South, et cetera, et cetera. So the deep racism of the South in the United States express itself clearly against the uh, Haitian Revolution, which was a threat to some extent to uh, the uh, existence of a slave-owning class.